Good morning, kiddos. Happy Thursday, February 25th. We have a special staff birthday today. Today is Miss McLean's birthday, Miss Kathy McLean. She is one of our Spanish teachers. And even though she is out right now, she hasn't been with us um, this year. Um, she's still with us in our hearts. And I know that you guys who have had her before love her to pieces. And we miss you, Miss McLean. So I didn't want to um, pass you over. We hope you have a wonderful birthday. Um, and we certainly hope that you don't have to make your own dinner tonight. So we hope somebody cooks you your favorite dinner, Miss McLean, and we miss you. Um, kiddo birthdays today are Victor Cuevas. Happy birthday to you, Victor. And Shamir Silva. Happy birthday to you, Shamir. What are you going to pick for dinner? I hope it's yum. And then we've got Alema Bashari. Happy birthday to you, Alema. And Solomaya Semshishin. Honey, you know what I always say. If I mess that up, please email me and let me know how to pronounce your name. It's important to me to pronounce your names correctly. Solomaya Semshishin. Happy birthday to you. Um, you got a pretty day for your birthday, and I certainly hope that you get the best dinner and whatever it is you choose. We have some shout outs. I love it. Four shout outs today. This is exciting. One of these is um, from, uh, oh, anonymous. You know what that means. I can't say the name of this person. So here we go. I'll try to do this. Uh, this person would like to shout out Brian Corona in seventh grade for being a super duper good friend. Thank you, Anonymous. And thank you, Brian, for being a good friend to Anonymous. Miss Cathcart wants to shout out three kiddos who have turned in a ton of NTIs. And just like that, you guys, their grades improved. Imagine that. Imagine what would happen if you did your work the first time around and you didn't have to kill yourself doing NTIs. Do your work on time. It makes life so much better. So the kiddos who have improved their grades for Miss Cathcart are Xavier Barksdale, Jasmine Denesaka Hernandez, and Ian Gwynn. You three, I appreciate your persistence and getting this work done because it's never too late to climb out of a hole. And Miss Cathcart, I appreciate your persistence in not giving up on your kiddos. Um, kept after them and they got it done. So thank you, Miss Cathcart, for that. This one is uh, from Ronald Ramirez Alvarado. Ronald Ramirez would like to shout out Mr. Force for being such a nice person and Ronald loves his class and also Mr. Bates because he's such a nice math teacher and a great guy. Ronald, totally agree. Mr. Force and Mr. Bates are great guys and great teachers. So thank you for taking the time to shout them out. And this last one is from Dr. Allison. Dr. Allison would like to shout out her entire sixth grade class for teaching her how to use the icon at the, at the top to insert pictures instead of copying and pasting. Dr. Allison, that is so cool. We can learn so much from our kiddos, especially about technology. And I'm not sure that I know how to do that. So I'm coming to your sixth grade class so they can teach me the same thing. So thank you sixth grade kiddos for helping make Dr. Allison better. And thank you to Dr. Allison for always learning. Um, you guys are the best. Um, Black History Month fun fact today. Hiram Rhodes Revels became the first African-American person elected to the U.S. Senate. She served from February 1870 to March 1871. Thank you to the Black History Month Committee for sending me all these um, really cool fun facts. And thank you guys, all of you kiddos, for responding to my question yesterday. I think I had 20 responses to the question about Thomas Jennings and what he got a patent for. Um, you guys took the time to jump on your computers and do some research and then to email me the response. So three of you were digital kids, so your treats are already in the mail and the rest of you were in-person kids and you got little Debbies. And the most fun part was that we got to chat about him and about what patents are in your classrooms. So for those of you who don't know, Thomas Jennings invented the first form of dry cleaning. So dry cleaning is when you take your fancy clothes to a place and they 
clean it um, in a way that helps the clothes keep its shape. And I, I don't even know if they use liquid. I have no idea how you do dry cleaning, to be honest. So um, Thomas Jennings invented kind of the first version of dry cleaning, and it was called dry scouring. And 20 of you took the time to look that up and teach me all about it. So a patent is when you have an idea or you create a product and then it's yours. Like nobody can take that idea without giving you credit for it. So that was a lot of fun. And I think that we'll do more questions like that in the future um, because I love that you guys interacted with me via email and, and took the time to research for me. I learned something new yesterday. Um, kiddos. That Saturday night is movie night. Cannot wait to see the ones of you who signed up to come. It's going to be an amazing night. Um, thank you for working hard every day in your classes. Please go to help sessions today. Please ask lots of questions. Please be persistent in um, pursuing your education. I know this is hard, but you can do it and you will do it and we will help you every step of the way. Teachers, Tomorrow is food truck Friday, only for staff. I'm so sorry, kiddos. We do fun things for you too, but tomorrow it's just for teachers. We get to have Edie's barbecue, so please bring your credit cards and your cash. All staff members, custodians, bus drivers are invited to go outside and get yummy food truck food as our final little kind of celebration for Black History Month. It has been an awesome celebration all month long. Love you. See you in your hallways and classrooms. Bye.